What's up, everybody? I just wanted to make a quick video on the MetaQuest 3. Specifically, I want to focus on just the pass-through mode. I think that's one of the biggest features on the Apple Vision Pro and one of the biggest things when it comes to this, you know, new realm of VR that's kind of getting people interested. Aside from people who play games and different things like that, I think this is where it kind of shines. This right here. So ignore that music video that's a looks like an old school t-pain song <laughs> but uh so right now we on instagram right here right so one of the cool things is you can literally zoom in like i think this is crazy right here um now i know you can definitely do similar things on to like the vision pro but this is crazy so with the meta quest and also this is in hand tracking mode that's why my hands kind of look invisible right here which is pretty cool right here i have facebook i just want to kind of show you that you can do you know basically multiple apps Mind you, I'm sitting on a couch, so I don't have a lot of space. So, look, when you want to type, boom, you got it right there and do that. So, that's cool. And then right here, I got YouTube showing like, he... random reels and stuff like hey, that. Hey, I heard you got shot, but you're going to be okay. Let's see. Let's let's turn that off. Okay, so, yeah, we're on there. So, I just want to show, like I say, the, you know, just the um working on the app. And mind you, this is just the beta version of Instagram, so I'm not sure how they can improve on it because to me it's pretty legit already and like i said it's very reminiscent of you know the one you use on your phone the one you use on the ipad um the computer version is kind of all the same but one of the coolest things like i say is just being able to not only do it on instagram but doing this on any sort of website and just being able to kind of oh here's that little typing feature that i was showing again so you know what let me number one let's zoom out let's see what do we have on here Mm, let's see man who remembers when the all-star games used to be good I, I think we all missed that so let's go here i want to see if i can give y'all a quick demo of this keyboard oh let's see so i'm gonna pull this a little bit closer or actually i thought i was gonna pull it closer but yeah so if you do oh sorry about that so generally you can basically go look we'll just go to google And boom, hit the enter button. I'm just moving the keyboard. So let me see. Actually, I can make this screen bigger. Let's see. Let's just type in super. And I, I keep forgetting, too. You can use both hands. I'm right-handed, so bear with me. <laughs> but, uh... Let's see. Let's look. There it goes. Super Mario Bros. The movie right there. Let's let's go to that. So, boom. This is what it's like to kind of browse the internet. Mind you, you can do the same things. Zoom all the way in and stuff like that. Let's see. Let's just go on here. We're trying to figure out a cool way to show this off. And See, on this, you should be using your left hand. Like, boom. Just like I just did right there. Let's see. You know, let's just open in a new tab. And it definitely takes a little bit of getting used to just because like what I noticed too with anything, right? So with anything like this, this is kind of like your home bar with anything like this, the further you're away, kind of like the more like wobbly our hands are. It's no different than when I'm shooting a video, you got that telephoto lens. You're like, damn, I thought I was being steady, but it's one of those things. But the cool thing is you can always switch to a mode like this and boom, now you have literally everything kind of sitting in front of you. So, let's see, you know, I have a couple apps on here. I need to put some more, but yeah, I just wanted to kind of do a quick video just to kind of show you just this right here. I think, like I say, this is probably one of my favorite features, and honestly, I think this is one of the best features on the Vision Pro as well, but um, the fact that you can kind of have the screens on here. So, hey, quick video I just wanted to make. Um, like I said, I'll, I'll be making more videos in the future, but this is what I wanted to show, and whenever you want to end it, you basically like, so there's two ways to do it. You can turn your hand like this to create the little Facebook knob right there and go like this. Or, well, let me activate it again. Or, look, I can press the camera button 